So you might be trying to figure out how you can change the passcode on your iPad. Now doing this is actually very, very basic and it really doesn't take too much time. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna make sure you know the passcode first of all so you can go and change it. So in this case, once you're logged into your iPad, again, if you don't know the passcode, you can try Face ID, you can try Touch ID. If you don't have any of those things, then obviously this may not work for you. So what you wanna do is you wanna make your way over to your specific settings panel just like this. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna to wanna to scroll down until we see basically passcode unlock or face ID and passcode. In this case, we have face ID and passcode here. And all we wanna do is go and click there. Now it's going to ask us to type in the passcode once more. So we're going to go and type in the passcode. Now once we go and type in the passcode, you will come into this panel. Now all we're going to wanna to do here is basically scroll down for the most part until we see our change passcode option. So right here, you will see change passcode. So all you're going to have to do now is go and click on change passcode and you will come into this panel. So now it's going to tell you to enter your old passcode. So all you want to do here is to enter your old passcode. Once you type it in, you can go ahead and set up your new passcode. So here, all you're going to have to do is go and click on passcode options. If you want to change the length of your passcode, if you want the six figure one or whatever it is, keep it. But if you want to change it to a four digit one, which we have right here, four digit numeric code, which is more common, you can go and click there. And here, all you're going to have to do is type in the passcode. So in this case, if you want to change it to a bunch of zeros or whatever you want to do it, you can do it like that. And that's all you're going to have to do. So once you do it a couple of times, you want to click next, you're going to tap in the passcode again. And then after that, your new passcode will end up working. So that is pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.